Now we're still dealing with ranges. And this illustration is uh, illustrating the use of table 220.55 that deals with ranges covering column C. Now notice we have a 9 uh, to 12 kW range here. So we're over uh, three, uh, 8 and 3 quarter up to 12. Uh, not over 12 now. And you can see that's a 10 kW. So as long as we fall within that range, over 8 and 3 quarter kW up to 12, we can take step 1 there and apply uh, what the question is. And the question is, what is the demand load for a branch circuit serving a 10 kW range? Find the demand load in VA. So that is the uh, question. Now we're going to get uh, the answer. So step one, we're applying column C uh, to our table 220.55 and one 10 kW range. There's no math done. It's given to us. It's 8 kW. So step two, we take the, uh, uh, say the uh, 8 kW can, and just use it into volt amps like the code does now uh, in adding all this up. And this was a, a proposal that said that VA was more accurate than uh, KW and so forth, uh, where there was strictly resistance, that there was uh, more, uh, more, th more uh, values make up uh, a circuit, you know, such as capacity reactance, reductant reaction, and all that kind of thing. So uh, step two is just taking the KW and making it KVA so that you can multiply it by 1,000 and get rid of the K and have VA rating of 8,000 VA. So the answer for the demand from column C to table 220.55 is 8,000. And always remembering uh, as a designer, electrician, or inspector, not that you already don't know this now, demand is always less than one, less than 100%, as you see in our solution uh, of this illustration and figure 14-6.